Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new video. If you do go on to enjoy today's video then make sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel to see more content like this. We start things off with some insane Gordon Ramsay rage. He had a customer complain about the food not being done very well. Ramsay upon close inspection insists that it's very well done and the waiter's denial just sends him into a huge path of rage. Burnt my ass. I've never seen such a fucked up service in all my fucking life. Unfucking believable. Two sausages. Yep. 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 Okay. Now we have a clip of Ramsey being served a grilled salad. Emphasis on grilled. He does not know why this is a thing, and even the waitress was rather surprised that this was a thing. Ramsey was so shocked about this, he had to find out from the rest of the customers if they thought this was normal. And if anyone else has ever had a grilled Caesar salad before, anybody here? Ladies? No? Sorry for interrupting. Sorry. Gordon Ramsay took a look at a restaurant storage of food and he found some really sickening stuff like moldy lemon and so much more spoiled and rotten food lying around there. He called the head chef and questioned about it and well, some fireworks went off because Ramsay and the chef got into quite a heated fight. Check this out. To me then, they just went from this morning. You bullshitting little fucker. No, you're the little fucker. I'm telling you, this was made today. Oh, right. If you don't fucking believe me, that okay. is your responsibility. So that is your thing. You're lying through your teeth. I am not lying yes, through my teeth. Yes, you are. You can't. Ramsey came across a chef for whatever reason had no clue how to cook anything. He had about a day and a bit to teach how to cook certain things. As expected, there were quite a few clashes during this drastic time. This is one of the funniest arguments you will ever see Ramsey have. It's all about cooking muzzles on not knowing how to cook in this case. Right, are you going to tone your voice down or are yes. you going to shout like some dick? I'll shout like some dick and then I'll calm down. Right. Now I've shouted. Well, why don't you fuck off down. to the bookshop, read how to cook a muscle, and come back and see me? Yeah. Okay. And I'll run your fucking restaurant. Thank you. Ramsey was very much right in the thick of it in this kitchen and took charge. He was barking orders at everyone, and when things were going wrong, then, well, you know how he can be. The beast was truly unleashed in this clip. And this was right up there as one of the biggest raging moments. Now, who the way they're taking oh. they're missing it. Fuck off. Get on the phone, get your job back. Where's the tart then? Let's go! Burnt my ass! Yeah. I've never seen such a fucked up service in all my fucking life. Gordon Ramsay wanted to get an insight into the hierarchy of the restaurant he was in. And, well, what he discovered was very amusing. Someone there claimed that he was the manager amongst many things, but the actual boss came through to clear things up. And it left Ramsay in quite a state of shock. Assume the role. Oh, shit. You just assigned that role to yourself. I just assigned that role to myself. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Are sweating. You I'm sweating. You're sweating? Yes. I'm shitting myself. I'm also shitting. Ramsay really sensed that there was something really fishy about the restaurant restaurant he was in. So he decided to take a deep dive into the kitchen, storage and fridge to find out if everything was in order. His suspicions was right because what he found was absolutely sickening. His reaction was absolutely hilarious. Just check this out for yourself. Oh my god. Is that flounder? It's definitely old. It's definitely old. It's green. Smell that. End things off with Gordon Ramsay being absolutely baffled by someone's sauce. The chef really thought his sauce was really great and was actually talking it up, but according to Gordon Ramsay, it did not live up to the hype at all. Ramsay actually had a really funny way to describe how it tasted. It's fair to say that it took everyone by surprise. I need to know why he chose those words that he used. Sci-fi sperm. Sci-fi sperm? Yeah, where's the, where's the orange juice? So it's an orange squash. A concentrate. You know, all the reports from the people we do eat love Thank you guys for watching this video. If you guys did enjoy this video, then feel free to leave a like and subscribe to the channel to see more content like this and much more. I'll see you guys next time, but until then, take care and uh, cheerio!